This past week has been absolutely insane for Indian poker. Just as the Durga Puja and Navratri celebrations were winding down, Poker Bazi turned up the heat with its 10th anniversary celebrations and the 2024 GOAT, a 25 crore sheet be behemoth with a 5 crore stock price that had everyone talking. The final tally of 15,172 entries fell glaringly short of the ambitious target, resulting in a record breaking 11.81 crore overlay, a staggering 9.83 crore net loss for Poker Bazi. But for the players, it meant insane value. When the dust settled, two names emerged from the wreckage. Kabir Chatwal and Sanjay Chaudhary. Chatwal etched his name in poker history as the GOAT 2024 champion, taking home a life-changing 3.11 crores. Chatwal's win, an astronomical 31 times his previous best score, catapulted him to number 8 in the Player of the Year rankings. But the real shocker came when a heads-up deal saw runner-up Chaudhary walk away with a mind-blowing 4.14 crores, the biggest single online payout in Indian poker history. Chaudhary's record-breaking payday rocketed him to number 3 in the POI race. Their achievements were so monumental that they've both been crowned our Poker Guru Stars of the Week, a well-deserved deviation from our usual weekly trend. The GOAT final table was a gold mine, with all eight finalists achieving their career best scores. Mohammad Azhar, the inaugural NPS India main event champion, finished third for a staggering one crore. Other big names like Akshay Kapoor, Neeraj Satavat, Raghavendra Rajana, Om Prakash, Pramod Kumar, Siddharth Karya, Debayan Das, Nishant Kumar, Satyam Barma, Shobhit Jaju and Ankur Sehgal also walked away with massive online scores this week. While the online scene was ablaze, the live action was just as hot at the 2024 focused as EPT Cyprus. Santosh Suvarna, fresh off his impressive fan and table appearances at the EPT Barcelona, narrowly missed adding a second EPT title to his name in the mystery bounty. Despite entering the final day with a short stack, he made a commendable comeback, finishing fifth for 29.09 lakhs. Ankita Huja also had a small score in the Eureka main event, finishing 223rd for 2.13 lakhs. The EPT Cyprus main event is currently underway, drawing a massive field of 1,229 entries. The main event is down to 144 players, with Bulgaria's Fadim Mustafov leading the pack with a hefty stack of 920,000 chips, just ahead of Russia's Ivan Zabiakin, who holds 915,000. Santosh Subarna is also still in contention, carrying the hopes of Indian poker fans into day three. And there's more live action on the horizon. The Delton Poker Tournament is returning to Goa with the all new DPT Grand, taking place on both the Casino Delton Royal from October 22nd to 28th. With 15 tournaments on the schedule, this is the one festival you don't want to miss. That's it for this update. I'll be back next week with another weekly roundup.